Hey everybody, it's Mike Frieder here with On Call Compliance Solutions, and I'm back with another compliance tip of the week. Today we're talking about NIST SP800171 Control 3.1.17, Protect Wireless Access Using Authentication and Encryption. Now on the surface, this may seem really obvious to you, but believe me, it's not. If I walk into the typical uh, defense contractor that's of the small to medium size, you know, again, uh, one to 5,000 employees, you would be so surprised at how many wireless networks there are floating around the building, hooked to the main network, totally unprotected. So if I was to give a sample answer to this, I would say it's implemented. The wireless network is protected via authentication and encryption. FIPS 140-2 WPA2 is currently in use to protect wireless traffic, and all traffic is fully encrypted. Only authorized users and devices have wireless access. So, again, a couple things here. One is <clears throat> the encryption level that we're using, it's going to match up to the government mandated FIPS 140 2 for protecting things, uh, protecting CUI when you can't physically protect it, i.e., wireless networks. Uh, WPA2 is a great starting point. And then, of course, uh, we're saying only authorized users and devices have wireless access. So, i.e., only authorized users, only company owned devices that can all be done via policy. You can always change your wireless password, kick everybody out, and then, hey, look, IT gets to decide you know, who's got that wireless access. So again, all of that is really critical. And hey, if you're trying to get compliant with DFARS, NIST SB800171, or CMMC on your own, and you're looking for help, our compliance experts are always on call for you. Visit NIST800171compliance.com or check out the bio below for links to make life easy. We're only two clicks away. There you can find more information about how we can help self-schedule time at your convenience with one of our compliance experts through any form on the website, or even learn more about our completely done for you services that can have you on your way to being compliant in just two to three days. That's it, just two to three days, no, no big commitment there. Uh, love the content we're putting out for you. Help us out with a big thumbs up on that like button, or even better, smash the subscribe button to get the latest compliance content as soon as our compliance nerds roll it out. They love doing it. It's a great way to stay prepared for that upcoming CMMC certification. Everybody's going to have to eventually get through it anyway. Until the next time, my friends, uh, please be safe uh, and secure out there, and hit us in the comments below to let us know what you'd like to know more about when it comes to information security and compliance. I'll see you on the next one.